I'm back to square one. Yay. So I did get a job offer with this uh, company called a White Cloud Electronic Cigarettes or something. Uh, the interview went pretty well. Um, it was about, I think, I forgot when I did it. I think it was like two days ago, I think. Um, the problem was is that the job required me to be on my feet for 11 hours. Um, with my club feet, that's pretty distressing actually, but I decided to go ahead and say yes because I was just desperate for a job and of course after I said yes it was like telling a really bad lie and then um, I went to bed tonight and I could not sleep. I think I got maybe five hours sleep stops and so I called him this morning and said I couldn't do it. Shame because I think I actually would have liked the job but I was like kind of distressing about like Olive Garden and like what happened with that. And, I don't know, I don't like letting people down and um, fun stuff. So I'm unemployed again. Um, I did sign any contracts, so it's, I'm not going to have any problems with, um, yeah, with any legal problems at least. Um, I am still very, I still, I just feel really like I just broke up with a guy or something. Um, like I broke up with a relationship. Like, oh well, yeah, sure, I'll date you, but wait, never mind. I, I just find you as a friend. We, we can't do this. Yeah. And I was the one who, of course, broke it up because I was too scared to proceed with it. And now thinking about it, I actually probably could have split that. I don't know. It's too late. I've already caught him. It's, there's nothing I can do about it. It's just, it's just distressing, very distressing. And I hate social anxiety. I hate feeling like crap all the time. Um, I just said the probiotics, and of course I'm not taking them every day because I keep forgetting. Um, it's got there's five inches of snow outside, so if I want to go somewhere, it's almost impossible. My brother, he now has a job as a logistics logistics manager, and I don't understand why I can't be that lucky to be able to find a good job, but. I could be able to enjoy it. I would love to be a logistics manager, sure. It would be shipping and, of course, you had to do inventory for 12 hours yesterday, but, um... <coughs> I just started checking on it. Yeah. Um, anyways, I just, I am throwing a pity party, but this is more for myself. I am really distressed because I can't be able to make a decision. I try to make it, let other people make the decision for me, and I still wasn't happy with it. I think I should just start trying to trust myself more and see if I could be able to um, trust my own decisions and I just noticed that half of the hemisphere of my face is not in alignment like when you split my nose like this yes. um, I don't know I want to exercise today Owen he um, he got me some video or something it's called insanity but unfortunately my asthma is up backing up and then I get a choking on mucus and dying for about like an hour and a half. I want to go walking outside, but I can't do that because there's so much, it's negative 10 degree wind chill. So, yeah. If I started making up my bed, I'd actually maybe have some kind of self-confidence. But, um, I don't know. I'm just very depressed. I'm taking my medication. But like I said, I didn't get any sleep last night. And I'm back in World of Warcraft. Um, I'm reading as a shaman, resto shaman. Like, I love the game, but it just eats so much of my life up, and I feel like that's the only thing I have in common with Owen. I like Owen. I think I see a lot of positives, but I'm just sitting there like, if I didn't have the game, then what else is there? By the way, nobody else is going to be ever seeing these videos except for me. These are more just kind of seeing, just out of curiosity, like what my thoughts will be in a day or two. I'm going to try to make these videos about six months long so I can just be able to rant. Oh, Joy Java just decided to uh, interrupt me there. I'm trying to, I'm trying to find ways to better myself. Like, I'm going to church Sundays, Saturdays. Tuesdays and Thursdays is karate. Mondays is D&D. Maybe I got too much going on. Of course, I'm trying to get 
I was trying to do the small group stuff on Tuesday, but of course it got canceled because of the snow last week. Um, I haven't had any other interviews. I haven't had any other responses. I want to get into bank teller position if possible. Um, I just, I just had a gut feeling telling me not to take that electronic cigarette job. This, if you had asked me a year a year ago, I think I would have, um, I think I would have taken it, but. Uh, it's just something about working at a mock kiosk for 11 days and then having to sit there and slowly get depressed by trying to think about everything in your life, kind of like what I'm doing right now. And I think I'd rather have a job that kept me busy, that kept me away from these kind of thoughts and make these kind of videos. So, um, yeah. I want to get rid of the stacking couple. I guess it's a personal problem. I mean, I've got water, I've got food, I've, I'm, I've got a nice family. I mean, I'm happy I do that. But, at the same time, I'm just very depressed. Everybody else looks like they got their life going for them, and then, then you just have me just sitting there. And I'm not happy. I overreact, I'm impatient. I'm not confident. I just still don't see what everyone sees in me. But I just hope I'm not trying to make a relationship because of my self-esteem is so stinking low. I mean, I like Owen. He, I mean, to me, he's a good-looking guy. Um, he's got like my quotation checklist of guys. I do want to. I do want to better myself, and I do want to. Maybe if I exercise today, maybe I'd feel better. I mean, if you look at my eyes right now, they look like they're like black from like no sleep. Maybe, maybe a guy will find me comical. I don't know. Would I ever take a guy or Owen? I don't think so. But it is a long distance relationship and I mean I've got experience with those but this is actually the first time I've ever actually had a guy be interested in actually giving me back a feedback. So I don't know if he's desperate <laughs> or if I am or how it's going to work. I mean I really do like this guy. I'm not trying to convince myself. I'm just... I guess I'm just questioning, I guess he's like the same way, like, well, why is this other person interested in me whatsoever? <laughs> Interesting news today, um, well actually it was yesterday that Justin Bieber got arrested for um, drunk driving and it was actually fairly funny because um, his mug shot, he was sitting there grinning, like you know when you have like the face shots like this, he's sitting there going, right in front of the camera, act like it was a, a joke, and he got a $2,500 fine, that was only a $2,500 fine, when he was spending $75,000 on just strippers at a strip club. <sighs> I'm interested to see if this guy's going to like overdose in himself in the next five years or something. Uh, I think it's a really shame that all of these celebrities have these problems, that they but they do this to themselves. It just really mind boggles me. I need to stop touching my face. I just realize it. Um, I feel so much like that character from uh, the Guild. I just she's like insecure and I mean I'm trying to make myself secure. I'm trying to put on makeup. I'm trying to make myself feel better. And I just I'm a very unhappy person. No matter what situation I am, I think even if I didn't move down to North Carolina, I would find something wrong. And it's just very depressing. And I want to change myself for the better. I want to stop sleeping until 12 o'clock in the morning or at night, whatever. No, it's the morning. Yeah, 12 o'clock. Actually, 12 o'clock in the afternoon if we want to go. That'll go here, but... I'd like to get into the degree that I actually, I've been applying and I haven't heard anything back. Um, like I said, these are going to be daily videos, just for me. Nobody else is going to see them. If they see them, then I will be, uh, if you end up watching this and I have not given you permission to do so, please, just for privacy, can you just not, I mean, these, I have the... I have the availability, availability to be able to make like diaries for myself about having to take up so much hard space. Um, you're really crossing a boundary of trust for me for watching this. 
because you're seeing the part of me that I don't really want you to see. Um, I just thought I'd throw that out there. Anyways, I think I'm going to end the video now, and uh, I'll update tomorrow how I'm feeling. Hopefully, it's going to be a better day tomorrow. Alright, bye.